All right, James, thanks for joining us. A 1-0 win away to Northampton this afternoon. A tough, a hard-fought win, but a very satisfying one. Yeah, um, definitely a satisfying one. I think um, we looked more of our old selves. Um, we looked resilient. Um, I think the message was um, it's been disappointing in the last few games where we've um, maybe started off not so well, not on the front foot. So I think um, it was a positive start from us today. The first 45 foot we were on the front foot. Maybe a bit unlucky not to go in up. Um, but then, yeah, the message from half-time was to carry on, do not let the standards slip. And then I thought we pushed on second half and, um, yeah, deservedly got the three points. So there were three changes to the squad. Um, you came in as well as uh, Matty Harold and Dale Gorman. It was a brave call from, from Ross to, you know, to make the changes, but it, it definitely paid off. Yeah, I think it's very... Um, very different from last season. Obviously, last season, um, pretty much the majority of the season was constantly up. So it was um, maybe less changes throughout the team, um, maybe less rotation. I think this year is our, our first year back in the league, so there's going to be different changes um, made consistently. And I think um, I think Matty's waited um, patiently for his chance. So I thought he done really well today. Um, Cormo the same has been in and out a bit, but I thought he was excellent again today. Um, yeah, and I just thought we looked solid. Um, I think there's going to be chances for everyone this year um, to maybe cement your place or to make um, make the shirt your own. But I think all the boys that come in today have done well. And to you know to elaborate on Matty Harold, it, it was his rather sensational pass that set, set you up for, for what turned out to be the winner. I mean, it's not often where the, uh, the pass might um, sort of overshadow the goal, but uh, it w was two good, two good impacts from both yourself and uh, Matty. Yeah, definitely. Like I said, um, he's waited patiently this year, Matty. Um, he's a man of great experience. He's the leader throughout the dressing room um, to pass on his knowledge. Um, and I think he showed that today. I thought he was incredible. Um, he keeps himself in great shape. He showed that today. Um, blew up maybe towards the end. Um, but yeah, can't blame him for that. But I thought he was he was excellent and the assist was great. And talk us through the goal. Um, yeah, um, towards the end, just trying to stay on my feet, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I see the keeper go down and just try to try to lift it over him. And uh, you know, Matty's partner Connor Wilkinson also made a, a big impact. You know, he hit hit the post and hit the bar, so it didn't quite go in for him. But he, you know, was a constant menace and, and did his defensive duties as well. Yeah, definitely. Connor's chipped in with um, with a couple of goals recently. Um, I'm sure he wanted another one today, but um, all round play was excellent today. He's linking up. I think, like you said, he really complimented uh, Matty well, chased the flicks on. Matty held it up well, yeah, so them two look really good together. And just the final person to highlight was was Marvin Epiteta. It was a bit of a blow after just five minutes for Samling to come off. Um, and Marvin Epiteta is not a natural right back, but he looks natural. Yeah, I think Marv's athleticism, his um, physicalness, um, like you said, you're never really, as much as you, you say you're prepared to come on at any time, you're never really prepared to come on that early. Um, but I thought he handled himself well and fitted right in. Um, yeah, he looked good as a right back, even though he's probably not played it many times. But um, yeah, he looked very strong. And 960 O's fans made the journey and it was good to celebrate with them towards the end. Yeah, definitely. They've, um, they've supported us all season. Um, it's going to be a season of mixed emotions because of various factors. Um, but yeah, they've, they've supported us in great numbers throughout and we hope that continues.